Speaking in the House of Commons on Thursday, the Chancellor Rishi Sunak revealed three new measures to support businesses and workers. The first, a grant scheme, will allow open hospitality, leisure and accommodation businesses in Tier 2 regions to claim up to 70% of what closed businesses can claim under Tier 3 restrictions. Furthermore, the grant will be retrospective, meaning a business will be able to backdate their grants to August. First, I'm introducing a new grant scheme for businesses impacted by Tier 2 restrictions, even if they aren't legally closed. But I'm providing enough funding to give every business premises in the hospitality, leisure and accommodation sectors a direct grant worth up to £2,100 for every month Tier 2 restrictions apply. The second will see changes to the job support scheme. The government will now pay the full cost of employers paying two-thirds of people's wages who can't work. It will also mean that employers will only have to work 20% of their normal hours to be eligible for the scheme. This is down from the original 33%. If businesses are legally required to close, as we've already outlined, the government will cover the full cost of employers paying two-thirds of people's salary where they can't work for a week or more. First, under the original scheme, employees had to work for 33% of their normal hours. Now, we will ask them to work only 20% of those hours. Finally, the income support for self-employed people will be doubled from 20% to 40% of their average incomes. Today, we are doubling the next round of the self-employed income support from 20% to 40% of people's incomes, increasing the maximum grant to £3,750.